So at the Usha research, first, we want to know what was disease. What is disease? Because it seemed to be misinterpreted. Everyone is talking about departmentalizing or individualizing disease. When you have diabetes, it's different from having leukemia. When you have sickle cell anemia, most sin is not like leukemia. They are different. When they are not, they've never been different. They're coming from the same source. The mucous membrane of our biological structure has been compromised, meaning that the mucous membrane has been broken. And wherever that broke has taken place, that break has taken place, would determine the disease that you would manifest. Like, for instance, like we always say, if the mucous membrane has been compromised in the nasal passage, it is what? Sinusitis. In the bronchial tubes, bronchitis. On the lungs, pneumonia. In the pancreas, diabetes. On the brain, schizophrenia, paranoia, or Parkinson's disease, insomnia, depending where the mucus is located. So we took the position, and we maintained that position, that there is only one disease manifesting in a thousand different ways, the compromising of the mucous membrane. So that led Ma'a and I to think about not only addressing to one part of the body, but to address the total body, because the body is all interconnected and interrelated. We can't treat one side without the other. So we say, just go for it. An intracellular cleansing. Self-explanatory. Cleaning every cell that makes up every organ and system that totals the biological you. Meaning cleaning all of you. Not only your colon. Like many have decided to do. To concentrate on the colon. No. We concentrate on the whole human body. Cleansing the human body is only but one part of the whole journey. The other is bringing back the energy that was lost by the presence of disease. That energy is supported by minerals, live minerals, phosphate of iron, phosphate of calcium, and phosphate of everything that we're going to use will have to be phosphate. Why? Because they, and they alone, are electrical. So as we recommend the intracellular cleansing, we know that the person in question, patient or client, has suffered the loss of energy by the presence of such disease. So, apart from part one, which is the cleansing, now we have to revitalize the system because it has been weakened. We can't select comfrey and golden seal, aloe vera, peppermint, and genesia. No. We have to go to Kalawala. We have to go to Contrivo. We have to go to Cordoncillo Negro. And we have to go to the one that I favor most of all, the Pavana. Now we are talking about electric herbs for an electric body. After we selected these plants, these electrical plants, we made these compounds. 